You know, I've learned a great deal about the left over the last four plus years, and the most glaring is how angry they are. Obviously, it's not all of them, but it's definitely a majority. I mean, they are extremely self-hating, even to the point of hating people for not hating themselves. It's a very strange mindset, but I will never understand celebrating someone's death simply because of their politics, and that goes for both sides. But it speaks volumes when rest and piss and rotten hell is trending on Twitter celebrating a man's passing to cancer. That's an internal issue, and you should probably reevaluate your life. Because these are the same people that probably have hate has no home here signs in their front lawns. I mean, it's always the party of peace, celebrating a political opponent's death, dancing on his grave because he hurt their feelings. I mean, this really shouldn't surprise any of us because they don't want to unite with us. They want us dead unless we conform to their mindset, and that's a very dangerous game to play. But I will say Rush was the type to use the hate to build himself up, and he probably loves that he's living in their heads rent-free right now. But because they always celebrate death, we need to make sure our voices are always louder than theirs. And to be perfectly honest with you, if my enemies celebrate my death this way, then it means I've done something right.